Good morning Father God. We would like to start our day with your word, we humbly ask your Holy Spirit to help us understand your message O Lord. Please forgive our mistakes Father God, and help us to be worthy to be called your children. This we ask in the most precious name of Jesus Christ our Lord and Savior. Amen. Choose the narrow path. There are many people in this world who prefer to take the easy way out, rather than do what it takes to accomplish the task. If something looks like it's too much work or too demeaning a task, they just walk away. Perhaps someone has always dreamed of being a doctor and was smart enough to pass all the exams and be accepted in medical school. But when they got there and realized what it would take, the many hours on duty at the hospital, sleepless nights, and endless hours of studying, they say, no way, that takes too much work. So instead of realizing their dream, they end up in a dead-end job they hate, all because they wanted the easy way and refused to walk the narrow path to success. The Bible gives very clear instructions in Matthew 7, verse 13, Enter through the narrow gate, for wide is the gate and broad is the road that leads to destruction, and many enter through it. Don't be like everyone else. Instead of following the crowd, thinking it's not cool to follow Jesus, choose the narrow path and stand up for what is right and allow Christ to shine through you. It's not always easy being a follower of Christ, but you can count on the Holy Spirit to protect, teach, and guide you in every step you take. So, when you think about that, the narrow path is actually the easiest path after all, because you are holding God's hand. And when clasping the hand of your Savior, you just can't go wrong.